I'm Blue Moon. And I'm Red And today we're going to be reacting to Attack on Titan Season 4, Part 2, Episode 25. Woo! We're excited. Yes. Shots are going to be fired this episode, but they ain't going to be coming from Thunder Spears, if you know what I mean. Yeah. <laughs> we're excited. We're mm -hmm. home for spring break, so ignore the background mm -hmm. and probably crappy audio. It's only for this video and maybe... Maybe the next one, yeah. maybe. But anyways, if you're an anime only, you're safe with us. We aren't going to be spoiling anything past this episode, besides in the manga only discussion at the end. So when we tell you anime watchers to get out at the end of the video, we get out it. or else you're getting spoiled. Yeah. So besides that, let's get into it because I'm excited to see Dilf John. Yeah, I, yeah. Enough of spoiling the episode. <laughs> let's get into yes. it. Yes. Of course, Sean. Anything for you. <laughs> You'll get it. For sure. Oh, I don't remember, baby. I guess this is just dream life having like a family. Mm -hmm. Who's that? It looks like somebody. Uh, uh, oh. He has a whole mustache. Thing. He's like imagining he's in like France or something. I know, it looks like Paris or something, right? How does he know what those are? I'll be living in Paris with my wife and kid. <laughs> oh, actually, Haji's. Uh, hey. Uh, what? Like, get out of like? Paris! <laughs> You're coming, coming. That's uh, so sad, actually. Oh. He doesn't want to think about it. Like, he could have easily went with, like, flocking everyone and just kind of eventually maybe, maybe had that. But, but it's not even promised. Yeah. And he can't go back to how he was. Mm -hmm. Me too. Me too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she probably right, feels she's bad. I had to update her because she's been gone. Like, sorry, the commander, me, couldn't be there to help right. you out. <laughs> yeah, definitely not. Yeah, he only has like a little scratch. Yeah, so. he's fine. <laughs> oh my god, the scene. Oh my god, no. I kind of do a lot of close up shots for this. It's cool. Okay, good. I can't believe that he's like trying to make it's like how it's like feels like that we are in the conversation. Silent. Mm -hmm. They're like not even aiming at anyone's face. They're like scenery shots for the start. <laughs> That's very true. I mean, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's like what yeah. Mm -hmm. like the, to it, right? the Marlians' like worst fears about the Eldians would be coming true, yeah. and even though they won't be able to attack right away again, mm -hmm. they'll definitely try to retaliate. Like, you can't just get away with like genocide. they hold on to a hundred years of history; they're gonna hold on to it again. Yeah. Hanji. <laughs> exactly, Hanji. Exactly. You fucking. Yegris, listen to her. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Like, seriously. Like, what if, what if, we shouldn't do this, we should do that. It's like, well, it's just wrong. Period. Yeah, we have to do it's something. It's wrong. You can't negotiate that. Oh my god, there's no opening. Uh, yeah, everyone thought about it, Hanji. Hanji wanted to live in the woods. John was like, let me live in Paris. Mm -hmm. Not the comrades. <laughs> right. Is it freedom? Like, they're the only ones that are experiencing that freedom of the walls being gone, but it's not even. Uh, the music. I like how the music just comes in for this. Like, it's silent the rest of the time. Mikkei. I saw my boy Mobley in there too. <laughs> oh no! Marco, oh, Marco, he's so cute. <laughs> I love Marco and Matthew's style. Uh, oh, no, this, this is so beautiful. beautiful. Oh, I, I was not expecting it to be so beautiful. I did not expect there to be an opening. I was ready to sing the rumble. <laughs> Damn, oh, man. I don't know if I can make jokes this episode. I'm going to cry. Ooh. I'm not a potato. No. <laughs> Frank, I forgot what this episode's about. <laughs> I was like, I'm a potato. I was like, oh, this is sweet. Oh, wait. Uh, I forgot. Uh, 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 Ryder's saying cross like it. I don't know, that's why. 
Ready just staring at her while she's doing all the work. I mean, you gotta eat somehow. Right. Come on. You're just gonna like take food out of the bowl and go to different parts of the right? forest. That's just that. even more awkward. Boom. Don't start with the <laughs> yeah. That's true. Yeah. She's like, like I said, you're not listening. Right? <laughs> uh huh. They didn't know what he was gonna do. <laughs> they would have been on the Igor side if they weren't that. <laughs> <laughs> the warning, oh god. It's already bad. Alright, they kept saying it to And you. Exactly. Marty's talking about justice, but there's Marley sending Titans over to Paradise for years and years. Gross. Maggot, shut up. He gets quoted to Maggot every time he says something wrong. Yeah. Yeah, listen to your Maggot. Oh, yeah, that's very true. John understands. There's an inciting incident there. Oh my god. Is that a history nerd? It's like talking to like a history nerd in school. You're like, oh my god. This just reminds me of sitting in my psychology class while a bunch of kids are debating about like the existence of God at night in the morning. Oh god. Oh god. This is the vibe I'm getting. <laughs> that's me during class. Yeah, when you're minor, like, oh my god. I can't. Yeah, let's stop. That looks so good. That does. I wonder what it is. Potato soup? Maybe. Yeah. Exactly. Thank you, Anji. She's like, boring, didn't sign up for history class. <laughs> He's barely hanging out. It's like, it's like, leave it to Hanji to see both sides. Mm. Mm. I get why he's skeptical of what, so. Right, they can't just turn a blind eye to what they saw. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just like Reiner and Annie now. <laughs> John, <laughs> there's nothing to say to that. That's a big question, especially for Mikasa. Mm -hmm. You're all friends with mm -hmm. Falcon's like, I kind of like my partner <laughs> to sit in there like this. <laughs> Like it's a uh, show and tell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Falco's thinking, I kind of liked my camp, my camping trip with uh, <laughs> Connie better than this one. Right, what are you gonna do? Kill him or persuade him? Right, they want other options, but everyone's just like, you gotta kill him, that's the only way. Right, if you manage to even talk to him? Like, nothing is guaranteed, so you have to come up with the plan here? Plan A and plan B? Oh, I like Annie's nose. Mm -hmm. Not as good as how we drew it though. Yeah, yeah right. She's like, I don't want to get to endgame and then for you to not tell me to kill Aaron. Yeah. She's right. Like, like it's true. She doesn't want to help them if she thinks there's an ounce of them just turning against them in the end. Oh shit. Uh, Mikasa versus Andy from season one. Let's go. Oh, your headphones there. I didn't even see him. <laughs> Levi's like. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm skipping this episode. <laughs> Goodbye. Hmm. Yeah, don't, don't fight. Uh, okay, understanding? Exactly. You understand people's feelings now? Alright, <laughs> mm -hmm. great. But if you can't, you gotta don't tell me what you need to do. She's like, don't stop me. Yeah, to whatever. Oh, Nanyo Capone's like, oh god. Hi, hi. <laughs> she said, shut up. Dinner, kids. <laughs> so now you're done talking about killing your friend. Um, or your family member? Let's eat some dinner. <laughs> oh, uh, I can't believe I'm seeing any of this anime. I thought I would never would. <laughs> She's like, ignoring you, kind of sort of probably. I would ignore that. <laughs> He said, so you were working with them. I do not care about this right now. We got bigger fish to fry, maggot. <laughs> oh my god, Yoina. All these people want to start problems with each other. Uh -huh. I kind of like how they're aiming to scenery a lot, because it kind of shows that like the characters are not looking at each other in the eyes. They're lost in the forest of Yeah, they're not seeing eye to eye. What's this? She doesn't really want this. What's this and shit? He said, shit, dumbass. 
Yeah, you're right. I don't know why she's on fight. Park. Well, she can fight, but against everybody, she's yeah. eager to die. <laughs> and like the individual shots, everyone That's just so shows cute. how they're so like far apart. Uh -huh. You know. <laughs> He's like kind of sending far from her too. He's like, I don't really know about her anymore. <laughs> right, she's Marlian. Yeah, right. Everyone thought, everyone thought she was Even though LD. surprised. Uh huh. Oh, oh shit. shit. <laughs> You're not LDN like you said you were. Mm -hmm. She's wanted to be a part of the drama? Yeah. Mm -hmm. She's like, okay. Okay, and? <laughs> I'm gonna write my own stories. I'm putting myself in the narrative. <laughs> I am the style. Must mean robots moments. Yeah. She's like, I'm gonna be part of history. I'm like, for that. <laughs> I'm meeting Zeke whether the world wants me to or not. Uh, <laughs> 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 okay. Why are you petting her? <laughs> oh, she looks like this. <laughs> yeah, she looks like this. Oh, she's 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 like yeah, they all think they're doing the right thing. Mm -hmm. Oh god. You she said, you're talking about me? How are you guys? How are you guys? You want the drama? I'll give you the drama <laughs> since you wanted to talk about me. Soup Midgar. I can't read it, but I'm assuming it says what kind of soup this is. I know. She's like, let's read everybody's character bios here. If you want to read mine, let's get a lot in the open. She's like, you kill a lot of LDs. Guess who else is here? LDN. Today should be bad at you. <laughs> Annie. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you kill a lot of Survey Corps members. So you remember back in season one? Yeah. Do you we see all the Survey Corps members around you? Yeah, they should be bad at you. <laughs> That's so true. Everyone seems more moral than things. Yeah, Armin's like Armin. the most morally correct person here. He killed somebody and he killed yeah. Armin. You killed a bunch of Marlians. You know who else is here? Marlian. There is you at it. <laughs> yeah, they also killed a bunch of Marlians who are also here and mm -hmm. should be at it. <laughs> Especially Oh, God. How did she know that? I guess, I don't know, maybe they talked to her, I don't know how they know I'm pretty sure that. Elena wasn't there watching, as far as I know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Everyone so knows that, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> she was on the ship, so she's... Mm -hmm. you know, I don't know Elena likes her. Everyone, no one hates Sasha. <laughs> she got kind of sad about Sasha. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, I guess she's kind of willing to admit that. <laughs> she's like, you're probably way more sad than me. He said, anyways, you're not starting shit. And Haji's like, okay, finally, someone's trying to stop this argument here, John. I'll give you some. Distract from that conversation. Yeah. Thanks, Yelena. God, why oh, the fact that he's saying thanks when, like, she's about to unveil the biggest piece of, like, yeah. he said, heartbreaking news. Anyway. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Call her out, too. He said, you killed a bunch of people to get here, too, so shut the fuck up. <laughs> she said, oh. Hmm, let me think about that. Oh, I got nothing to say about your performance. <laughs> she said, one more day. Actually, <laughs> I forgot. Oh. It's like, what was it again? Um, Marcus? Marco? Oh yeah, Marco. What? I don't know why, John, would you tell her that? Don't know why they're having gossip time with you like all the time. <laughs> oh. Hanji, Hanji's like, shit. <laughs> poor, poor Gabby and Falco, we sit in there witnessing drama go down between friends. I know, like, Gabby had to sit in the... The table seat oh, right. the <laughs> Oh, she's winning it. Oh, God. She's admitting. Oh, she's oh, trying oh, to take oh, it. Oh, Ryder, oh, you could have said that unless you wanted, but he felt bad. <sighs> that is so awkward. Marco. I love the sky. 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 I love He's given detail about this. <laughs> yeah. I love how one death all the way in season one can have such a big impact on like, all of the characters. And he was like barely in like two episodes. <laughs> <laughs> the fire thing. Oh god. Oh, oh my god. 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 Oh 
Imagine what would happen if Erwin was here. <laughs> He's like ready to accept it too. Uh, I love his last word. I love Perfect how it comes back around. So, so Right, imagine what would have happened if Marco and them talked. Right, we didn't have to find out all these secrets over four seasons. <laughs> Marco was hella smart. I know. He was like so close to figuring it out. Yeah, so early. And they didn't even know about like Aaron being a titan. He was like, that's so Yeah. Right, right. We're already breaking boundaries. We're already doing God's work. We're sitting together. Okay, that was your cue to stop talking. And he knew that. When Tom's ready to accept it, he just had to bring him back again. She's like, why are you throwing yourself more into the bus? <laughs> like, I did not need to do that. He's like, yeah, like, yeah, shut up. He's like, anyway, I feel bad about it afterwards. Like, that would piss me off, too. Oh, my God. He didn't, like, I get it, Reiner, but he didn't need to say that. It just made it worse. Ugh. Okay, Reiner. Oh, my God. That was your character. Because it's just like, cute and wrong to say it's okay, but he's, he's not going to Yeah. Take yeah. That. He's not going to forgive you. <laughs> I love writers, but he deserves it. Yeah, he deserves it. Oh, uh, how, how realistic. Cool. This, this season has so many realistic oh, punches. God. They really let him go for it. Yeah. Uh, uh, why are always being punched? He got punched by Andy when he was younger. Like, he got kicked in the face last episode. Uh, I forgot. He actually kicked down his writer. Oh. <laughs> I see Griffin on this one. Uh. Oh, his face. Uh, right, they're brilliant. Can you ride her losing two? I know. It sucks for everybody on every side. She's gotten beat by like two adults at the moment. If you see Gabby once again, it couldn't be me. Like they're just kids. Mm. Right, it's funny he had a dream about having a kid and now he's looking at two kids. He's they're like, like, please, please, please. Uh, oh my god. Uh. <laughs> I don't think he's hungry right now. I'm just really trying to cheer him up. So John, I want you to sit here and eat your seconds. <laughs> Just to sit here, you don't have to look at any of us, eat your seconds. <laughs> right, and, and they have more character development than Maggie, because Maggie was trying to start his, <laughs> some shit, and now he's like, shoot, these kids are more mature than me. Right? Maybe I gotta reconsider my life. He's there, that's so funny. He said, shut, shut the hell up. I was trying to skip shut this episode. Up. You're too loud. Uh -huh. Oh, that's, that shot is so sad. It's one of my favorite shots in the manga. Because he always holds his ears inside. That's so cool. Oh. <laughs> that's really pretty. That's probably scary for He's her. like, wake up. No. He's like, tap through everything. He's like, wake up, wake up. And then I would not wake up if he didn't go over to John. He's <laughs> like, wake up. Oh my god, he pulled my hair out. I'm sorry. <laughs> Why they're even sitting like so spaced apart? On their... <laughs> they're like sitting like <laughs> this. is so awkward. Get the. Uh, <laughs> he's yeah, he's an kicker. She's like, this is like this is fun. I'm like, I don't have a terrible bleeding or anything. It's fine. Yeah, you're not getting a problem. Not you though. I'm not talking to you. If you think that was directed to your room, it wasn't. <laughs> that wasn't a logic to you. If you even had an inkling that was directed to your room, it wasn't. <laughs> what about me? <laughs> Nothing. Right. Cause she I was part of it and he doesn't care. He doesn't care about anything. He's like, whatever. Was she just staring at Levi in the corner? And she was just like staring at him. Oh. He's looking good there. Ew. Yeah, gross. The steam engine. Oh yeah, the train they built is biting them in the ass. Um, that's cool. <laughs> Epic for them. Oh my god, I forgot about this. They make Fuck, him look so threatening here. He's, he's not threatening. Oh my god. No, that's so funny. He, look there's no him. thoughts behind those eyes. He does not know what to do. He's looking at her they're, like... They try making him look intimidating. Did not he's work. like, I kidnapped her. And now I don't know what to do. <laughs> okay, at least we got this. This show me. So that I came out. Hey, you need to get sweet. That's a no me what to do. Forget to me that ba. Onaji katachi onaji tayo na akuma. We're learning more of this. 
僕を止めてあいつはいいのそこに壁があってだけなのに生まれてしまったせかねのにくなるくらいの自由なんだから I'm gonna learn this whole thing、yes. by the time the season's over,、uh-huh. which I think is like two episodes. So I better, get, <laughs> yeah. better get with it. We're almost there, we're so close. <laughs> I'm not even just talking about this one minute ending, I'm talking about the whole entire thing. thing. We're really, really close to learning the whole thing. I love that it didn't have the opening. It like fit so well with the episode. I know, like, I did like, not expect it to it feel、was. so like tense. Yeah. I was ready to、so、make、beautiful. fun of them. I like, I, like, I like all the shots where they're aiming to like nature and everything. I think it just added to,、yeah. to the conversation. I don't know. It was really cool. I did not expect it to be so tense. Like, I was reluctant to make jokes just because it felt so like. I was like, I feel like I'm sitting in this room right now. Oh, <laughs> awkward. <laughs> It's like an embarrassment from all this conversation. <laughs> Especially from Reiner. He,、uh-huh. he had the chance to show up when he、uh-huh. kept talking. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, we're talking about、okay. that. <laughs> Stop it, you're gonna see. Ooh, m i x u This is gonna be an epic battle next.、Mm-hmm. Oh, God, not that. Oh,、uh, I wonder how they're gonna do that, traitor. Let's get into the anime only discussion first. Okay, welcome to the anime only discussion. We'll be discussing the, the anime, anime only. only. We have a lot to get through, so let's get started.、Um, the fire scene was, was fire. fire.、Yeah. And the shot composition as an art major and a film minor was amazing.、Uh-huh. I love the way they just had everything slightly off screen just、mm-hmm. to make it feel like so much more awkward and like unsure.、Yeah. Instead of like the characters being in the center frame where everything usually is, like in every single film,、mm-hmm. you usually put characters in the middle of the frame.、Uh-huh. They were slightly off to、They're、just、like、make、this. you feel like uncomfortable. Like,、yeah. Like, what if I did the video from here? Like, wouldn't that be like、yes. so awkward? I'd <laughs> just be like, what? Is so going I love on? how they did that, especially、okay. like you were saying. Like with Jean's scene as he's covering his ears, like Redmond said she liked it more in the manga, but I kind of like it more in the anime because it shows again like how he's lost in this forest. It just feels like so、yeah. vast and confusing. It does feel scary. I just like Jean's、yeah. face better in the manga. It's from a low angle too, it helps with like. His feeling. It conveys his feeling better. So I, I love、like. the shots.、Yeah. I know some people are going to be like, they just didn't want to animate the characters talking, so、no. they just aimed to a bunch of random shit. I think it had a purpose. It had a purpose, and it definitely made me feel vaguely uncomfortable enough to not make a ton of jokes,、yeah. although I still did. <laughs> Speaking of shot arrangements, they didn't really show a lot of imagery when they were talking about certain events, like Marco's death in the manga. They showed Marco half eaten, but Map was like, we're not going to animate that. Like,、no. well, you know what that looks like. We're、yeah. not going to remind you. Some shows like My Hero Academia is really guilty of this. Be like, oh my god, what All Might said last episode, they only flash back. You're like, half,、oh, I'm not you just watch the episode,、yeah. you don't need a flash back to it.、Uh-huh. Like, some shows treat you like you're dumb, but Tag and Titan's like, no, you know what we're talking about.、Mm-hmm. I don't need to show you a picture. You, you, got, yeah. it. you got it. You got it. You got it. So, I like that. Really kept us in the moment this episode. I just、mm-hmm. wanted to mention that. And now we're gonna talk about Marco. So, if you binge watched Attack on Titan,、mm-hmm. you're probably not that attached to Marco.、Mm-hmm. I know I watch other reaction videos. I know, crazy. Reaction or watch his reaction <laughs> videos. <laughs> Is it? But this one guy I'm watching, like, he does not like Marco. He's like, fuck Marco, because they bring him up so much.、Uh-huh. He does not care because he binge watched the whole、mm-hmm. show. But, like, I was watching it when it came out. And we had to wait so long between、mm-hmm. season one and season two that it's like you just dissect season one so much and get attached to every single th- character and every background character. So that's that, why I、yeah. said.、So People love Marco. Because we had to wait, what was it, four years? Fans that watched it since we began had to wait four years. I think we had to wait like two. Yeah. But still, like, for those two years, it was just Marco jokes on Marco jokes, jokes. on Marco and jokes. Just, so you just become attached. Yeah. yeah. And I love his freckles. I know. Oh. Okay, the lights are back on. It was funny how we were talking about we felt like we were in the fire scene, and life said, Say no more, you're there. You're, you're in, in the dark. dark. <laughs> you're in the dark next to the fire. You're transported there magically, like we were transported to the past or something. Yeah. <laughs> so, anyway, I like how in the upcoming episodes to this episode, they're mentioning John and his past. So, Marco being mentioned in this episode wasn't random. Like, it wasn't. Okay, okay. <laughs> I have a theory. I think Marco's ghost is turning off the lights in here. We can't say his name more than three times. It's, it's like, like Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice. We, we just can't say it more than once.、Yeah. So <laughs> I was gonna say, you know who when we're talking about, Mark. you know. Yeah.、Um, so, <laughs> what was I even saying? He wasn't brought up randomly,、mm-hmm. and I like how. He's brought in to reaffirm John's like. Because Marco was the whole reason John joined the Survey Corps in the first place. So yeah, it was like, nice that they brought him back to kind of like reaffirm John's goals and to get him back on track. Yeah, exactly. Remember in season one, he was like all indecisive until he had Marco's ashes, which they brought up last episode.、Mm-hmm. He just kind of realized, I'm going to do what Marco says and be a good. Wait, 
I'm gonna do what you know who says and be a good leader. Yeah. So I kind of brought him up. It was really fitting. I like how Marco tied. You know who tied into this. <laughs> You know who tied into this whole episode when Reiner brought back what he said about we haven't talked yet. Just, like, just his, last wor- his last words just tying back to the episode mm-hmm. was so perfect. And I like how in this scene, um, Jean was like ready to accept you know who's death until <laughs> Reiner was like, I'm sorry, uh, actually I tried saving him like for a split second, but you know, I just yeah, I'm, so- I'm sorry. And Jean's like, okay. He didn't need to say that because it's kind of forcing Jean to be like, oh, it's okay, but Jean doesn't want to accept his apology. Yeah, right, like, Reiner being like, I'm sorry, it's, like, my fault, like, blah, blah, that, blah, that puts John in the position of being, it's okay, it's fine, mm-hmm. when, obviously, you're not gonna tell Reiner it's okay. But, of course, he had to, like, be begging for, like, and forgiveness, it's okay. which I get, but, oh my god, he just made it so much worse, and then, later in the episode, when they're riding, riding on the wagon, and John's apologizing to Gabby, he's like, not to you. Not to you, Ryder. You're not. And, and then I, Ryder had to say it's okay mm-hmm. to John instead. They kind of reversed it. I've had toxic friends before. Whenever mm-hmm. they do something wrong, they want to make you feel guilty about the thing that they did wrong. Yeah, they're like, like, I'm the I victim. I'm the victim. I did that because I'm so messed up. And you have to be like, no, it's okay. When really they should be apologizing to you. So I like how John didn't take that from Ryder. I always forget that John is a fighter because he'd always fight with Aaron. And it was nice to see that back. Yeah, you know? I love seeing John, John back in action. That was the old John I wanted yeah. back. Just the punching. The punching. <laughs> he needs to do that more. Yeah. Also, I love how Connie and Armin were the ones to step in. It took them a hot minute to do so anyway. Right. <laughs> and Mikas was just standing right there watching. Like if she jumped in, Jean would be like, okay, okay. <laughs> She'd be like, she wouldn't wouldn't even have to jump in. She'd just be like, Jean, stop. He'd be like, okay. <laughs> Anything for you, Mikasa? He'd be like, oh. <laughs> was I just fighting? No, no I wasn't. <laughs> I was not actually. Next thing we want to talk about is the fallen comrade mm-hmm. scene with Hanji. We're gonna name all the characters we recognize. Mm-hmm. So let's jump into this list I wrote. We got the entirety of Levi's squad from Hedra, season one. All these guys. <laughs> the horse guy from season one. One, I think. Love horse him. Guy. I love horse guy. He's underrated. Hanes. <laughs> Sad. Moblet. Hanji's number one. The, I saw this post the other day. Mm-hmm. Saddest thing. Like the last thing Moblet saw when he died was Hanji. And oh, oh my god. god. This girl who died in Kenny's fight. Like he went to shoot Levi but shot this girl too. Mm-hmm. And Levi ducked. Yeah, she was there. Mm-hmm. This girl that died in the tower fight in season two. Two, yeah. And that guy. Um, and then this random girl, which I saw someone send me over, so I just wanted to mention yeah. it. I forget where she died, but she's a trainee. Yeah. So I'm, I'm sure the rest of the people in the background are from previous seasons, I just don't recognize them. So if you recognize any more people, let us know in the comments below. But that's all the ones we recognize. Uh-huh. This last bit is onto the minor stuff that they changed from the manga to the anime that we noticed just from our brief overview of looking at the manga. For some reason, they didn't mention this piece of dialogue when Yelena brings up that Armin ate Bertold. It's kind of redundant. Mm-hmm. It doesn't need, need to be brought up, so I get why they cut it out. Right. But it's kind of like an extra burn, because she's like, Armin, you stole this power from Bertold. And Armin didn't even get the choice in the matter. <laughs> right. Like, he didn't say, yeah, I'm going to steal his power from Bertold. Like, like he, no. he thought he was, like, sacrificing himself for the greater good, and he wakes up, and he's like, you're the class plan. Uh, uh, he didn't even, like, I'm glad they cut the out, because it's not really how it happened. They just cut out one of Yelena's absolute bars. <laughs> <laughs> she start your YouTube channel just spilling tea. Like, yeah. The tea on the survey core. <laughs> she would have an tea? awesome, like... Tea channel. Or podcast. She'd invite oh like each member on. That'd be so funny. I've watched no, she'd have a podcast. podcast. She would like bring in one member of the survey corps to talk and like spill tea about another one the next episode. They're like, you, you're not aligned with them, are you? Like, you like, no, I choose you over them. Yeah. Next, <laughs> next episode <laughs> of her podcast, like they were on. She's like, yeah, I hate John. Yeah, yeah. he was on my last episode. Don't like you. Yeah. Next, we want to mention the scene where Levi's getting up and saying like, shut up, you're so loud. Like in the manga, it was from a slightly different angle and you couldn't really see his hand injury. And I like how they changed it in the anime so you can see his hand and just see that he's like still really hurt. But I think I like the manga panel better. I don't know. Blue is arguing with me, but I think this is so much funnier. I think it's because it's like lower quality. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, today. that's true. Like, this is really detailed, so but it's also. Props funny. to Mepo, they're like, every time you should leave out, you're getting a high quality image of Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Shout out to them for that one. Um, also, in the manga, a minor difference was that Annie goes over to Reiner after he was being punched, which is kind of funny because, in the, like, obviously in their past, like, Annie punched him before, so it was interesting how she went over to help him after Jean was done punching him. But they him. didn't show that in the uh-huh. anime, which is interesting. I guess they're trying to make their relationship look more strained. Mm-hmm. But I like how that was, like, that in the manga. That's one of the changes I don't really like, but it's not that big of a deal. Yeah, it's really minor. All right, that's it for the anime-only discussion. We're moving on to the manga-only discussion. So, so if you're an anime-only, anime get out, or you all see regret Please. it, because we'll be talking about some major spoilers in this section. So hello, manga readers. Welcome yes, to the manga-only yeah. discussion. We'll be discussing the, the manga-only. Only. So let's get into it. We don't have that much to say mm-hmm. this episode, but 
I thought about this last night. I love how I keep bringing up the idea of like running away to the forest. Mm -hmm. Like Viva and Hanji brought that up this episode. Yeah. Shadis did a few episodes ago. And Hanji brings it up again this episode too. Uh -huh. And Jean was like, I'm gonna run away to Paris or wherever. Yeah. Imagine it. In an interior. Yeah, of I guess the walls. Would be interior. Yeah, but it reminds me of um, the future and future episodes where Aaron is talking to Mixa in the past when he's about to die and they're like in this little house out in the middle of the woods or out in the middle yeah, of the like field. Yeah, like he comes back from collecting wood, I think, and they're just living in the woods. Like and just they're like, like, in the past, they're apparently living there for a while, like they ran away together. Yeah, like just like everyone right now is wishing they could do, mm -hmm. like Mikasa and Aaron got to do that for like, I don't know how long in past. Right. <laughs> just like temporarily, which is so sad, but at least they got like a taste of it, like uh, everybody else really did it. Yeah. It's just, I don't know, just thinking about that made me sad and like, they bring it up a lot, so I like how it's brought up again in the future. Yeah, like, and that whole scene just in general in the manga upcoming is like so sad because it circles back to the very beginning of the first season, the first episode, like of Aaron waking up crying and, and Mikasa's is like, why are you crying? It's like, oh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> it hurts so bad. Yeah, it's extra relevant. I feel like because it's talking about running away together, like it's like extra foreshadowing that in like yeah. a really, really abstract way. I don't yeah. know. It's sad. It hurts. And the last thing we're going to mention is that it recently came out that MAPPA is covering up to chapter 130, mm -hmm. which is basically when the rumbling like start starts and the Titans start crossing the sea. That's a good cliffhanger, and I'm assuming they're going to put the flashbacks of like everyone and Marley right. in the movie if they're making right. one. Right, it's either a movie or part three. Which is funny, why do they call this season the final season if it's not the final season? Right, it's part, part, part one, part two, part three. But anyway, like season one, it was like the Battle of Trost part like 57. Yeah, yeah it was like so many parts. They're gonna have the final season um, part five. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, that's about it. Follow us on Instagram. We have an Instagram. Mm -hmm. We have three TikToks. We make other videos too, like this one, where we talked about our lives, if that's interesting mm -hmm. to you. And we have a Redbubble, so make sure you check that out. Yeah, see, see you in our next video. video.